need to order a new internet cord. Let me go ahead and add that to my card real quick. Before I forget. And we will check our unit. Well, actually, we'll check the map. Yeah, that could work. I'll have to look more into it. I haven't. I didn't actually realize that we were up to there. Hmm. I'll have to look into it. I'll do that later. Anyways, let's go ahead and do this. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I think this is how we wanted it, because you three were going to go to the right, as well as you two. Okay, so I think that's fine then. Yes. The battle of the eagle and lion is set to begin at long last. Everyone, show off the results of your dedicated training. Remember, we're not just fighting for honor. There's a prize that's true. It's almost time to begin. Steal yourselves, everyone. Bird. You all should know. I am not about to go easy okay. on you today. As long as we can pull off the win, it doesn't matter how. Our victory must be Okay, Edelgard. No matter what it would take. I know your secret, and I don't like you much. It is time. Forward, now! Rah. Doesn't even say anything. All right. The ballista in the center of the battlefield. The house that secured. Yeah, but still, I'm gonna try not to lose anybody. Is this a blister? That is a blister. Ash, get off the blister. I don't want you on it. Well, let's see. Put me in there. <clears throat> That's my cue. Oh, no. You'll be fine. Don't worry. Don't fret. Let us away. Rescue. Get some experience. Good job. Well worth the effort. I gotta say that actually was pretty good. You're both 18. Ferdinand probably could use it a bit. Mm, actually, you could use it a bit more. And only one of you should be able. Okay. It's gonna be a little bit risky, but. I will prevail. Well, oh, pardon me. All right, how much is that ballista gonna do? Oop. A fair amount. I'll be honest. Yep. 
I'm gonna come beat you up. As soon as I get an opportunity. Petra should be able to do pretty good. Pretty well, I should say. Good job, Petra. Black Eagles and Blue Lions are fighting. Maybe we can sneak right nah. past them. Nah. Don't think so. Hey, come back here. No, come fight me. Don't run away. There we go. Alright, Casper should do pretty well. And he did. Uh, let's see, either way, yeah, let's just get you in here. Uh, we can use one. Yeah, you should have enough defense. And oh, can't actually go that far. So right here would probably be the better spot to do it. Rescue, do that. Oh, you were using a steel sword. Interesting. Um, let's go ahead and do a wrath strike them. I will not be stopping. Yeah, okay. I am great. Yeah, wish you would have gotten a little bit of defense, but that's not bad, actually, Petra. Thank you. Ferdinand shouldn't die, I think. Or at least I hope. Let me guess who you're gonna attack. Yup. Oh, hey. Didn't even notice you, which was my fault. Aw, oh, dang it, Ferdinand, you didn't. You got hit, Ferdinand. Which is unfortunate. For me to seize. No, I don't think so. There goes Lawrence acting on his own. Guess we've got no choice but to capture the central hill and cover it. Okay, about what I expected. Oh, I actually was not expecting to hit though. I'm not unopposed to it, mind you. Just wasn't. Or seeing that. I shouldn't strain myself. New fire. Let's see, is that gonna be enough to kill you? It's only Thoron would, and that's not the perfect chance. So the better plan here is to do this. Yeah, this would be the best plan. Right Could have done a killer axe. That might have done a little bit more. Whatever. What are you doing? Oh, you're going for somebody else. Okay, not me. Actually, can we finish him off? Yeah, that's a pretty decent chance to finish him off. 
Please stop hitting me from far away. It's getting really annoying. Petro, you come on down. Okay, so you're going to go there instead, which you should be fine, I think. If not, I will turn back the clock. Well, just in case I... Well... Yeah, we'll go right here, just in case we do need a psychic on somebody else. Probably the best plan. I haven't even got to punch one of these kids in the face yet. That is unfortunate. Yes, that's right. Don't kill each other, just make each other weaker. What did I just say? Hmm, pardon me. Come on. Come and attack, Edelgard. Who? wow. Actually, I was not expecting you to have a chance to hit twice. That's... I'm glad you didn't. That was a little scary. <clears throat> Thank you, Kingdom Soldier. You helped. I actually mean that, too. Okay, so... Probably the best choice here. You could have at least tried. Need to do a helm sweater, okay. Which, that'll, that'll work, let's see. You will completely obliterate him. You won't. Have a plan. Wait, what? Why can you attack me? Short spear. Hmm. Mm. It's worth an idea. Well, I'm glad we didn't use all of these. Whoop! That's bad. That's real bad. I'll be real close. Of course, my real close isn't enough. We'll do you. See how this goes. Oh man, wish I would have known it would be crit. This turn may just not even matter. We may be turning back the clock here in a second, so we'll see. Which is unfortunate, if so. Well, I guess I do have that. I'm not going to use it, but I do have it. Aw, 
also goes to level. Not that it, it may not matter here. We'll find out. That's my cue. Tell me how this goes. Oh, probably gonna die. You could miss on the second one, Ingrid. Okay, that's what I thought. Yeah, no, I wanted to get experience. That should work. Let's get you guys away. I do have to say, the fact that you can turn back time a couple of times is a really nice feature, honestly. Only due to the fact that I just don't want to have to reset the game. Pretty good chance. Go. Your defeat was inevitable. Well done. This could still maybe not go the way I wanted to. Hmm, could go the way I wanted to though as well. We'll see. Still one other thing I might be able to pull off. Let's, I don't think it's going to. I don't think. Yeah, it's one to four. It's not. It's not far enough, which is what I thought. But figured I would check. Stay focused. This could still go the way I wanted to, though. We'll see. That's my cue. Put me in there. Put me in, coach. Okay, let's see how this goes. Please miss at least once, Ingrid. Oh, or Edelgard, you can gain back health and stop them. I'll take that too. Like, uh... Either option was manageable. Those are my experience points. You get away from them. Uh-oh. That actually might hurt. Wow, she actually hit twice. That That's a surprise. It's not a surprise in every box that I like. It's not the surprise that I like, though. It's the surprise that really stinks. Okay, so 
First, we'll start with this. Yeah, okay. That'll be a good starting point. Let's just make sure. Which is good for me. Am I done yet? That felt good. That was pretty good. Which would have gotten some defense, but I mean, I'll take it. Let's watch it one thing. You cannot attack. Good. Okay, you got a 100% chance. You can't mess this up, Fernian. Confused there first. One step before the next step. Be mindful. That should be enough to beat you up, though. However, I don't think that you're going to be able to get all the way over there. Definitely not, so. Let's get you your experience while we can. Oh, that lowers our attack. That's uh, not super great. Like, if it raised our attack, that wouldn't be so bad, but it doesn't. Our crit is fairly high, though. Well, good job, Liani. Should I have held back? Oh, but you don't have to worry, because we're not using you, so it's okay. How far can Psychic do? Actually... You should be able to survive one... Okay, you would be able to survive one hit from her, so that should be fine then. Okay. So I do still need you to get some experience there. Good job! That was actually pretty decent. Alright, so you're gonna go for Hubert, which is fine. In fact, I'll even bring him closer to you. And fire is fine. You'll be repaid. Time is now. Raphael, you chose poorly. Not even giving me experience, Raphael. The do, they do has a lot of uh, defense there. We might. Nope, oh, nope. And that's gonna come along for the uh, finishing blow, which is fair. Yeah, come, come hit Hubert. That way he can. Hit you back, get himself some experience, baby. Not enough to level, but it was a start, at least. Don't kill Dimitri. I want the experience. Well, that's not what I meant either. I guess Dimitri's gonna die. Oh, maybe not. Mm, probably not, but, uh. Oh, Marianne, isn't it? No. I thought she died there. She did not. Interesting. Was oh, everybody out of my range? Yeah. Everybody's one out of my range. 
This ballista is great. <laughs> 10 out of 10, wood ballista again. Oh, goodness. It's not their fault, mind you. No, okay. One truth prevails. I do wish it was easier to get case closed. It's kind of a pain these days, honestly. No, you don't have any, so... Okay. I'm assuming you don't have any, because I should really throw some vulinaries on you guys, but I just haven't. Like, I took them off thinking I didn't need them. I don't know why I did that, because that was a... It's not the best plan on my part, I'll be honest, but, uh... We're here now. Too bad you don't have Psychic yet, Flame. That could be really useful at the moment, honestly. We do... Well, I guess we... Rescue has proven to be useful, but... I want some new experience, I'll be honest. Might not be my best choice, but it is a choice that I'm making. There goes Marianne. Mercedes Benz, get over here. Gonna beat you up. Yeah, definitely it's still not close enough. Alright. How many of there are you? Just you. Just Felix. And he has swords. This is something I don't want to risk. Not until at least one of you has more health, so. I'm gonna wait a little bit longer on that. Ah. Got it, okay. All right, we have Restore instead of Psychic for you, which isn't your fault, Plane. I knew that. I mean, you didn't really, but I just needed the experience. But either way, thank you. Who haven't we moved? No, seriously, who? Oh, right. Those two, who we don't want to move quite yet. Lion Soldier, you're in for a bad time, I think. Ah, oh, you can even help me out, Lion Soldier. Oh well. Wow! Hit even to the trees. Good impressed. And you're our master brigand now. Good job. Time to set my aims deep. Not sure if he'll be oh you can definitely hit, but might be worth it. You can definitely hit too. Okay. Oh! That wasn't how I was expecting it to go. Okay, Casper, just uh, screw over my plan, why don't you? It was a pretty good level, gotta be honest. Sorry, but it's about time I make my exit. The rest of you, please finish the job. Not close enough to heal, unfortunately.
put you two in the trees. This will be a little bit risky, but we're going to try it anyways. Yeah. Does that make sense? I mean, I know it makes sense. I just didn't like the result. We'll work on healing both of you. I thank you. Yeah, that should be fine. Wait. Let's see. Not much else to do, I believe. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. <clears throat> Fortunately, Hubert isn't going to get much done up there, but that's fine. It is what it is. Uh-oh. Don't like that. Why don't we have it? I killed their leader. Like, we should have boosted morale. Just 21? Okay. And you missed, which is good. Don't heal. I want to see that. 14, all right. Oh, we healed a little bit of that back, so that's good. Wait, what? Oh, right, you have a short spear. I forgot about that until now. My fault. Totally murder me. Alright. So the plan, I think, should be to just fall back. Let's see who's going to be attacking you. You will not be. You will. You will as well. Just barely, though. So if I come here. Okay, you cannot. Okay, good. Let's worry about you. Should definitely be bringing you guys down here. Appreciate it. Well, you gotta level up, which is good. But you done some defense there, but I mean, that was a pretty good level up, so I'll take it. Thank you. How long will this take? You could really kill him. Okay. Oop, wrong item. Yeah, that should do it. Be a little bit risky, but we'll see how this goes. Bernadetta should be able to handle this, and she did very handily, in fact. Yeah, that's about what I thought. Um, as long as that hits, that would murder her though, straight up. I shouldn't strain myself. Stay focused. I should be able to get you.
I'm gonna risk it. This might be really bad. It might work real well too. Killer Queen bites the dust off. Yeah, like may as well use you. It's kind of what the killer axe is for. Let's keep at it. Okay, so we can indeed get that close to you, which is good. We will bring you right here. Just the regular. How far can I push myself with you as my foe? Well, I'm actually hoping to meet Tree that I get to punch you before you get to. Oh, we're gonna be slightly off. Hmm. We'll see how this goes then. Let's hope. Oh well. Oh, that's not good. That's also not good. Um. Shoot. That is not a very big range. Get you set up then. Okay. Not that it may matter. We'll see. Let's see how your aim is. Please be bad. Please be bad. It was not. Well, we're gonna have to rewind. Like, I know that we don't have. Alright. I will. Alrighty. No, we should get you back. Put me in there. Let us away. Stay focused. Oh no. Very good. Oh, how many of these do we have left? Three, well, all right. I might still end up regretting doing that, but uh, we'll see. her face to deal with still because we didn't kill her that's all right okay so it's fine I am Ferdinand von Eyre I 
That works. <coughs> Alright. So Dimitri went the other way. And you're coming up here. Alright. That's fine. And before we have you go attack Dimitri... Gone badly, but that didn't. But we're still not in the clear quite yet. Oh, no. oh pardon me. Stay focused. That will not kill him. That would be the wrong choice to do. Still won't kill him. So basically what I want to do is wait. <clears throat> you missed. Okay. That's not so good. By not so good, I mean that's pretty awful. Just and wait. Hmm. Kill it now. I will get the victory. Probably should send you down here just in case. Could work quite well, in fact. It'll work. It is, it is, but whatever, I'll deal with it. Could have been worse as well. No one makes it past me. Careful now. I should get some more hand axes at the very least for Bernadetta. Do nothing. <coughs> that made, that wouldn't be even worth it then. There we go. Oh, early. You have an ability, don't you? <coughs> well, you're not low in health anymore. You're not. Anybody low on health? Uh, actually, yeah. Duh. Yes. 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 What is it, buddy? 
Should be us. Suck it, Trebek. Yeah, I thought I might have. Good job, Casper. Who oh, pardon me? Edelgard, Professor, that was a spectacular battle. You both fought exceptionally well. Thank you. Complete and utter defeat. I would hate to make an enemy of you two. No need to get carried away with praise. I know you both feel we won by a paper. Not really. I mean, a little bit, I guess. If we were to fight again, there's no telling who would prevail. What do you think, Professor? I am honored to hear you say that. Still. I must continue to train rigorously. In any case, I hope the day never comes when we have to put the experience to use. Foreshadowing. Agreed. I would hate to know a future in which I'm forced to cross swords with you. True. Although the Battle of the Eagle and Lion was originally named after a war between the Empire and the Kingdom. But that's we'll keep going for about another hour. I'm sure even the name will one day fade from the pages of history. How admirable, Teach. On that note, I have a proposition. Oh. When we get back to Garrig Mach, let's have a grand feast to break down the walls between our respective All right. houses. And by a grand feast, I mean a fairly regular feast in the dining hall. It would be a fine opportunity to get to know each other better. Count me in. So be it. Let's plan to meet up on the night we return. Is that okay with no. you, Professor? Seeing such a big smile on your face is a rare gift. It makes me feel like I can maybe relax a little too. It's finally over. There are way too many strangers at that feast. Put your chin high, Bernie. It was a chance for you to have growth. But, but everyone was acting Wait, I miss so what was happening. Linhart, I wasn't done oh. talking to you. If those Alliance guys came at it from here, and those Kingdom guys came from there, I know, I know, we'd have been able to take them out all at once. Still, I we were able to take them all out anyways. Did anyone get the feeling that there were already couples forming? That's not really fair, is it? I wanted to sneak off the Shut up, Dorothea. <laughs> Casper's right there. I was hoping for some tea after our meal anyway. Would you care to join me? Thanks, but no thanks, Mr. Noble. I e, it's Casper. On someone else. Until today, I thought it would fall to me to command and guide our ranks all by myself. But with you leading us, I've gotten to experience what it's like to fight alongside everyone. And I've realized how happy it makes me, fighting under your command. The Emperor doesn't take orders from anyone. It's their duty to stand alone and lead the entire Thank you, Edelgard. But maybe it's better to have someone to rely on, so that you can support and guide each other through the darkness. I may be heir to the Imperial throne, but first and foremost, I'm your grateful student. That will never change, even when I fulfill my destiny and become the Emperor. I told you long ago that I wished to enlist you in the service of the Empire. Well, I okay. take it back. Now I wish only for your continued guidance during my eventual nope. reign. Don't just hide away in the corner, Professor. You're the reason we're celebrating. It's because of you that I've had the courage to leave my room for a bit each day. I'm, I'm so grateful, Professor! <laughs> we were all just discussing how well you led us. Remarkable. Thank you. Your guidance is without parallel, Professor. <laughs> you did pretty well, Petra. 
Your training's been top notch. Really? <laughs> Whatever would we do without you? I have had the opportunity to experience much. Please allow me to offer you my gratitude once more, Professor. I feel the same. You are something special, my teacher. I can only call your deeds during the Battle of Eagle and Lion. Quite Thank you, I think. Comparing against their performance at the mock battle of the Great Tree Moon, the students have grown significantly. Where's my where's my reward? This is a result of your guidance. In appreciation of your efforts and to show yeah, give me my rewards for the future of your students, I award you with this. Please continue is it a gun? to instruct your A gun would be really useful. I know it's not. So, you've made good use of all my power after all. I would have been upset if you had failed at such an easy task. It pains me to assign such a disturbing mission to you during such a blessed moment in time. However, next month your assignment will be to journey to Ramire Village to investigate an abnormal occurrence. I see. Ramire Village. If I recall, you've been there with your father many times. I have yet to ascertain the details, but it would seem the villagers have been acting strangely. I have already dispatched the knights to verify the authenticity of this information. They should be back shortly. I suggest you begin by finding out what. Well, that's fair, Sadith. I pray this is not a bad omen. May the goddess nope. protect you all. There's only one god, Rhea. Try again. I know it's just a game. Uh, blessed. Do we have anybody that uses lances? No, not really. Hmm, that's unfortunate. Part one, white clouds, red wolf moon, the flame in the darkness. Hoarfrost now graces treetops and open fields alike, and an icy chill blown in from the north of Fargus blankets the land. All of Fotland's creatures begin to settle in for a long winter. The setting sun Fades the full winter coat of every wolf in a foreboding scarlet glow. Hunters can now spread the word that the red wolves are back on the prowl. I hope that we see a change in season at the uh, school as well. We'll see. Oh, well, we're definitely not normal difficulty. We're in hard. Thank you, I guess, then, for, uh, for that. <clears throat> okay, cool. Sure. Why not? I suppose. I'm just going to come right out and say it. I find you a little difficult to be around. I know, I know. I'm your student and you're just trying to watch out for me. But the way you look at me sometimes, it's like you're seeing right through me. Don't worry. I know you don't mean anything bad by it. I'm just too self-conscious. Potentially. The thing is, I don't have anything to call my own. No land, no birthright, no fortune. Little knowledge or battle skill. I think that's why I always clung to my popularity as a diva. Even after leaving the stage behind, I sort of kept up the act. When I look at you, it's like your eyes are accusing me. Telling me that you see right through it. That's what I mean when I say it's difficult being around you. Hey, uh, this might be nuts, but maybe you could show me some kind of weakness of yours? Mm -hmm. 
You know my biggest fear. If I know one of yours, maybe I'll feel less... I don't know. Alright, that's fair. Excellent. Well then, don't mind me. You know, Professor, I never hear any gossip about you. Of a romantic nature, I mean. Would I be right in assuming you're not very experienced with romance? Whoa. Maybe we should find out somehow. Um, Professor? What's with you? Why aren't you reacting to anything I'm doing? That's creepy, Dorothea. Come on. Is your heart even beating? You're making me lose my confidence. That's all right. I didn't really think a little tease like that would be enough to get to you anyway. Though it does still make me lose just a little confidence in my own charms. Maybe you should rely on more than just charms, Dorothea. That's what we're dealing with. Is there no chance it's an infectious disease? There are no absolutes in medicine, but the chances are extremely slim. Restless movements, fits of violence, becoming bedridden, or even impossible to wake. With symptoms that varied, there are only a few possibilities. It's either a mixture of poisons or magic, and dark magic at that. You're talking about Remire Village, aren't you, Manuela? Oh my, if it isn't Gerald. Tell me, what was the first thing you heard? Everything, after you mentioned that it's not likely an infectious disease. My child and I owe the people of the Meyer village. If something's happening there, we must help. We will. Them. We scouted the area ourselves. Speak with the knights, hear what they have to say. I must go. Thank you for your help, Manuela. <laughs> You know, I'm more than willing to go with you to Remire Village. After all, I owe you my life. If you'd like, I bet we could even manage the Stop mission it. all by ourselves. Just the two Stop of it. us. <laughs> You're saying no? Well, aren't you just a great big nope. bore? I just, nice nah. Time. But I'll be going to the village as well. <coughs> Pardon me. It's time to move out. As you like. Goodbye, Gerald. Goodbye, Professor. Pardon me. I'll be in my office making preparations. Wait until the end of the month. If you have the time, it would be helpful if you could go ahead and talk to the knights. Hey. We're passing out now. Good night. Anything feels off, return to the infirmary. No need to just grin and bear it. Got it? Ugh, what could have caused such dizziness? I felt it too. Actually, I felt that way. Go on. Not, not gonna give us any more information? Okay. <clears throat> Thank you, then, I suppose, for not telling us anything. I don't think... Uh, I guess there's a couple people that we could. Okay. Bernadette is not one of them, unfortunately. Uh, Elgard. Casper, Dorothea, Petra. Mm, no. I'm not going to get you much, but I mean, hmm. That Every little bit helps. That Let's see. Ferdinand. Potentially Dorothea, though. Uh, your swords we could work on, but we're not going to.
That's better. It's better. Petra. Good. Now, hey, nice. Nice. We'll have to probably swap some stuff around, but that's not a problem. We'll have to figure out what to do for you after that. Since you only have one, I guess the only other real option is you, Edelgard. Fine, fine. Uh, two, 261. We'll go with this one then. I still. I still. Definitely do want Bernadetta. I'd really guess we'll do Petra, why not? Professor, may I ask sure. a question? Ah, I see. Yay, hey, Professor level up. Are we are we B now? Yeah. Professor. Oh, all right. Yes. I don't know how I didn't notice that earlier, but good job. Cause I definitely did not notice. You look unwell. It's because of what happened. I'll be right back and use the restroom. And then we will read the cat because I want to get back. Okay, let's see what they're saying. Once we actually get to the exploration part, then we learn from the catechism. Don't speak of it aloud. You 
You can't change the past. For now, all we can do is use it to our advantage. I know that. I also know that I must steel myself to ascend the Imperial throne. Those preparations are going well. We... Uh, someone is coming. Professor, I heard about our mission for this month. Something terrible is happening in Ramire Village. That's where you were when fate sent you our way. This feels preordained. Are the knights making progress with their investigation? If what is happening there is by design, there must be someone pulling the strings. There is the Death Knight, of course, and the mysterious mages who were implicated at the Western Church. They showed up when Flame was kidnapped as well. And now there is another strange occurrence near the monastery. It seems an unknown organization hopes to make the monastery... It sure seems that way, Hubert. Do you believe that all these incidents are connected, Professor? That is the logical conclusion, but I'm not well, so they sure. Are. It certainly appears that all of the events surrounding the monastery are connected by a single thread. However... I think it's possible that it may just be a result of okay, things overlapping. Remember, Professor. If you think of people as simply enemies or allies, it may be impossible okay, to Elgard. the truth. What's going on on Saturday? Ah, makes sense. Weeding is the perfect task for a recluse like me. I know a lot about plants too. You might as well call me Botanical, I botanical Bernie. That gives me surprise. I will be relying on you, Botanical Bernie. <laughs> we had a great result. Oh, good. Ah, so close, Flame. How long will this take? <laughs> I'm getting All right. Ooh, Vincio. Ooh, we can do silver now. Strong enough. That is unfortunate. Edelgard should be though. So. We'll check everybody else. For well, you don't need that. Casper. Yeah, Casper, you could use a silver. If you can wield it, Bernadetta, you can too. Go. Did did we buy? Okay, there it is. We cannot, which is what I thought, but. Wait, hold on. Is this the exact same thing? Except for better, but yeah. Okay. Uh, you don't really use that. You could use a silver sword, though. And a killing edge. Nice. On both accounts. Probably won't use the steel axe anymore, honestly, because we have a silver axe, so never mind. Uh, let's see. 
You got the iron axe and the steel axe. Shoe one. Okay. Well, good. I probably won't use that iron sword anymore either. Okay. Oh, all right. That's not bad. Don't have enough wood steel though, that's for sure. Be nice. Oh well, that's fine for now then. Maybe, let's see. Maybe, let's see. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll do everything we can. Actually, let's see. I don't know how many I have, so... Should be fine. Certifications. We have not maxed out ours yet. Edelgard is not high enough... Nobody's high enough level yet. I think they're getting close, but let's see. You're fine where you're at, Linhart. You are fine where you're currently at. Oh, you did it level 20 though, Linhart. Huh. Didn't realize that. Congratulations. I'm not going to do that quite yet, because we've got to have you finish off what you're currently doing, but... You're getting there. Uh, we probably should... Are you not good enough for armor tonight? Because of heavy armor, which makes sense. I probably should. Would technically make him a little bit weaker. And strength. And move, too. And we'll keep him there for now. Okay. So everybody else should be fine for now. Once you hit one more level, Casper, you'll be good. So we'll explore. First off, inventory items. I have actually messed up. Store. 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 Uh, you can get that. Uh, you can store the regular steel axe. So we're starting to run out of room, so hand axe. You could deal with a hand axe, honestly. Uh, we can store that. You have a silver sword now, so we'll go ahead and store that. I guess we'll store the regular steel sword, which should be good. Store that. Let's see. Don't think there's anything here. Hmm. I mean, if we used you, but we don't, so... 
Uh, let's see. Oh. That's a lance. Those are all lance. Why did I even check? Doesn't seem like much there. So, all right, let's read from the Catechism, then we'll continue on for about another 25 minutes. So I have to get up early again tomorrow. Otherwise, I'd be willing to go to 12. Let's see. Article three, sacred scripture. Part one, Christ, the unique word of sacred scripture. Paragraph 101. In order to reveal himself to men in the condescension of his condescension 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 pardon me of his goodness, God speaks to them in human words. Indeed, the words of God expressed in the words of men are in every way like human language. Just as the word of the eternal Father when he took on himself the flesh of human weakness became like men. Paragraph one oh two. Through all the words of sacred scripture, God speaks only one single word, his one utterance in whom he expresses himself completely. You recall that one and the same word of God extends throughout scripture, that it is one and the same utterance that resounds in the mouths of all the sacred writers, since he who was in the beginning, God with since he who was in the beginning, God with God has no need of separate syllables, for he is not subject to time. Paragraph one oh three. For this reason the church has always venerated the scriptures, as she venerates the Lord's body. She never ceases to present to the faithful the bread of life taken from one table of God's word in Christ's body. Paragraph 104. In sacred scripture, the church constantly finds her nourishment and her strength, for she welcomes it not as a human w word, but as what it really is, the word of God. In the sacred books, the Father, who is in heaven, comes lovingly to meet his children and talks to them. We will go ahead and read part two next stream. because We will be doing night prayer here in about 23 minutes. Ugh, Bernadetta. Talk to me. Hey, you don't have to talk to Elgard. Hello, Bern. Oh no, what did I do this time? Did I offend you? Is this your yes. revenge? No, not at all. I just want to talk. If you promise not to resort to violence, I'll do whatever oh, you Oh, Bernadetta. Bern, I've just been worried about you, that's all. When I said I was your friend, you ran away, saying something about your father. Remember? Um, vaguely? I know you've lived through some bad times. If you could tell me about it, maybe I could help? Oh, I don't know. Please. Your father's not here now. Whatever it is, you're and our father appears from behind the wall. All right. My parents told me never to befriend a commoner. They said commoners are scum, and that they crush any that tried to come near me. Hang on, scum? They called me, I mean, commoners. They called us scum? Yeah, but once, a long time ago. I did secretly make friends with one, a boy, and my father found out about him. He disappeared the very next day. I heard he was found beaten half to death. I never saw him again. Since then, I've been terrified of making friends with anyone, commoners especially. I... I never knew that kind of thing really happened. You, your stories, sure, but... Oh, oh, Fern, I'm so sorry. Proud to be your commoner friend. 
Nothing to ball about. If your dad tried to beat me up, I'd return the favor and then some. <laughs> She'd beat him up to Mount Bernadetta. When I was in the opera, you better believe I had run ins with the most wicked, terrible men. I survived kidnappings, attempted murders, all kinds Man, of Man, this is getting dark. But you know what? I broke those guys' arms. Snap! <laughs> it was a thank you for all the trouble they went through trying to hurt me. You're incredible, Dorothea. <laughs> so, now that you know I can defend myself, can we be friends, Burn? All right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah. Linhard, at least try to do some training. Use a staff or a rod or a broom for all I care. My apologies, but I cannot train right now. I have plans for later and don't wish to tire myself. Caspar invited me to train with him, you see. You slept through the whole debate, didn't you? Fine, I'll summarize it for you. Not the whole debate. I closed my eyes only after I knew what reading would cover the topic. There you are. Don't tell me you were sneaking out to do some training. Of course not. I was sneaking out to avoid you. <sighs> How did you find me this time? A mere coincidence. Why would you? So you can sleep. Because you're an awful nuisance. Why do you pester me so? To ensure that your talent is not wasted due to your lack of. It's none of your business how I spend my time or how I use my talent. Have you assumed the role of my mother? You overplay the part. She was only half as overbearing. What is the matter with you? As house leader, I'm trying to prevent you from causing trouble for yourself and our classmates. Fine, I'll try harder. Really. I'm sure you see all this as my interfering with your duty as a leader. Have you considered how it feels for those of us who serve below you? You are a serious pain, you know. How so? You're like a mother who insists on accompanying her son to his own knighting ceremony. That's taking it a bit far, don't you think? No, I'd say that it's putting it lightly. All you're interfering is greatly hindering my research. I see. Very well. You've made your perspective perfectly clear. <coughs> Petra and Ferdinand and Dorothea. Ah, oh, you're supposed to go up with Casper. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Oh well. Maybe later. Uh, Casper. Ferdinand, that's fine. Casper, I have been waiting. Ferdinand, waiting for what? I am going to give you a lesson on the righteous path of the noble. Righteous path? What? You have a problem with my path now? You think you're more righteous yes. than me? That remains to be seen. I heard you stopped a robbery in town the other day. Some despicable thief who was robbing an elderly shopkeeper. Rumor has it you didn't wreak as much havoc as usual. Hey now, I think you're underestimating me here. When the thief showed up, the old shopkeeper was so scared that he could barely stand. I didn't want the guy to pass out, so I had to stay calm while handling the situation. Rather than fighting, I gave my own money to the thief and told him to get out of there. Or else. How, uh, magnanimous of you. The thief fell for it and left the shop. That's when I chased him down. I got my money back and gave that thief a good... <coughs> he won't be back Sounds like Casper. Ah, so you walloped the scoundrel. That does sound like you. I am finding this story more plausible. Nevertheless, I think... Hold on. <laughs> now it's your turn. I heard a very interesting story about you recently. My turn, eh? Let's hear this story then. The way I heard it, you punched a foreign soldier right in the middle of town. Stop, stop. I know what you are getting at. But you have the wrong idea. Let's hear your version then. <coughs> Pardon me. Mm. I have been browsing for weapons at a rundown stall. Suddenly, 
a man seized the stall's owner and started dragging him away. Someone with a less generous spirit might say the peddler had it coming. His wares were quite inferior after all. But without a moment's hesitation, I leapt to his aid and soundly defeated the goon. Well done. Sounds exciting. It was nothing, really. Anyway, the old shopkeeper let me in on the details. He said that he was a novice trader, tricked by a noble into selling low-quality goods. That ruse was about to come to light, so the noble had sent a mercenary to keep the shopkeeper silent. So that's what really happened. I just heard you snapped and attacked some noble servant. I figured it was worth asking about. Well, I won't deny it. I forgot my rank for a moment and let my instincts take over. Is there something wrong with that? It sounds a little like something I would do. And your, uh, gentle approach to handling that robbery. That sounds like something I might do. You were not overcome by your impulses. You kept a cool head. For the most part. I think we're starting to rub off on each other. Always looking for a way to defend justice and to lift each other up. Partners in justice, eh? Well now, that I can agree okay. Too much dialogue. Too much dialogue. Hey, Fernand and Petra. There we go. There's one I was looking for. Taking care of some weapon maintenance, Petra? You seem completely absorbed. Yes. Taking care of the weapons has great importance. I cannot argue with that. That weapon there, is it from Bridget? No, it is a weapon of Dagda. Like the people of Bridget used... I mean, used them often. Fascinating. I have read about the weapons of Dagda, but this is my first time seeing one in person. Lots of weapons and fighting techniques came from Dagda to Bridget. Ah, so Dagda to the west had a big influence on the Bridget archipelago. I am fascinated by foreign fighting techniques. Would you consider teaching me sometime? I will. But it is difficult to explain fighting with words. We can try sparring, maybe? Yes, a practical demonstration. I would be quite grateful. Let's have our beginning, then. <sighs> Perhaps we should stop there. Oh? Do you no, he's just tired. I'll just practice more. From Dagda? Oh. Yes. Now that I have experienced it firsthand, <laughs> I used to look down on foreign fighting styles. I was clearly remiss. The footwork, the nimble way you shift your weight is extraordinary. I will have to remember those moves for the next time I am in battle. Clearly, you have honed your skills through practice. Your fist felt as sharp as a spear. Bridget is stuck in between Dagda and Fogler. It is of much importance to hone our fighting techniques. I am of the royal family, but I am a warrior before that. I must fight to live and to protect my home. When the alliances of Bridget and Dagda encroached on the Empire, they were always driven back. But perhaps the Empire's victory was due to geographic advantage or divine intervention, rather than military superiority. Having met you, that is what I think. I cannot help but feel a little disgraced. I held foreign fighting styles in such low regard without ever seeing them for myself. When I came to Fogland, I felt disgraced for many things that I learned. But there is no disgrace in losing ignorance. We need to be learning and growing with each other. Always. Yes. By working together, we can make progress. And both sides need to look ahead to the future. I know the world building, but sometimes it just feels like it's a little too much dialogue. spirits today, Dorothea. Yes. I have met someone quite charming recently. I'm hoping we can spend more time together soon. Well, I wish you the best of luck. I wish I had some advice to offer. Alas, I do not. Eh, don't worry too much about it, Aidy. I guess romance isn't really something you're interested in anyway. I'm not completely disinterested. Oh, yeah? Hubert. Is there someone you have your eye on? 
To be honest, there's nothing resembling romance in my life at present. It's not that I'm disinterested. I'm simply too busy with other endeavors. I have no time to spare for such things. That's not surprising. You're not just any old noble after all. Anyone who has feelings for you, well, they're in for a pretty complicated life. True. And I can't ignore the possibility that I may have to marry for political purposes. I doubt I'll ever have the opportunity for a passionate romance as long as I live. Well, that's no way to talk. You meet the right person and boom, your passion just there. Could be someone you've just met or someone you've known your whole life. There's no telling how life will go. Something could even spark between the two of us. You and I? Now that is an entertaining thought. If such an exciting future is in store, I look forward to it. Oh yeah? <laughs> That's awfully sweet of you, Aidy. Alright, last one. <sighs> we can do a little bit more before we go to bed. Not much more. I want to be asking you a question. Oh, please do. Why have you come to Garrick Mock? Is your gold different from the rest? Yes, I suppose. Everyone here is an heir or an heiress. But not me. I'm just a commoner. When I enrolled in the Officers Academy, I was different than everyone else. I wanted to secure my future, and my big idea was to marry money. Ever since, I've been dating different, terribly well-to-do men, searching for a good one. So far, there's been no reason for a second date. Okay, then. Marrying money? That is not sounding I like agree, a good Petra. idea. Money would be a bad husband. Pretty much. But you treat me well. I have so much gratitude. Why do you show me such friendliness when I am not money? Oh, no, Petra. This isn't like that. I like spending time with friends. It's wonderful being friends with you. And I hope we can stay close for a while. Almost like what a relationship is, and you shouldn't be a gold digger, Dorothea. I have that hope too. But I have also been thinking of who is good for me. Oh, I see. And still I am thinking we should be friends. Oh, I know why. Because we're both trouble for Imperial nobility. Yes. We both have troubles. Feels nice, doesn't it? Knowing that together we can irritate that many people. Since we've already got a lot in common, let's get to know each other better, shall we? We done? We are. Good. I do not know why it is so, but being here makes me feel quite unwell. I am so sleepy, and it, it is a struggle merely to stay conscious. Are you feeling oh, the same? I mean, at the moment I am, I'm getting tired. And yet, it feels <clears throat> as though pulled from a corner of my memory, from a time long ago. I simply cannot fathom it. Wait, I do want to see one thing. Nope, oh, okay. Hello, Shifty Merchant. Things we can't obtain here. Right, right, yeah. I remember you now. Alright. Yeah, I should make sure there's nothing in these rooms. Like, there probably isn't, but, I mean, you never know. No missed items that way. There's a lot of quests this month. 
Which is fine, we'll get to them probably next time, admittedly. Not this time. Eh. Oh, there's one. Not bad. <coughs> Looking more for word stones now, but uh, I'll still take it. I guess we'll talk to you. Do you have time for a request? Okay. Do I have to talk to you a second time? I might have to. We'll see. Hi, Dorothea. Congratulations on winning the battle of the East. I certainly feel like I earned a special reward. The palm. Dis I'm sorry. 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 It was worth a shot. If you had any. All for good until next time, so neat. I guess. Hey there. Look at like four more minutes. Nothing in here. <clears throat> Pardon me. I didn't even see what that was. Oh, hey, cool. You're still gonna have to come have lunch with us though, Bernadetta. You're not getting out of that. No, ma'am. Hi, Manila. I know you figure medicine and magical healing are two ways to do the same thing. Medicine is all, but magical healing is focused on closing up wounds. Hey, Gasper. Hey, Professor. Did you see that my father came by during the Battle of the Lion? I did not. Lion? He left soon after, but I saw him talking to Edelgard oh. first. I wonder what they could have to talk about. I guess that would make sense. Still, though. What's this? 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 What's that? What's that? <coughs> oh, pardon me. Hey. Yeah, hey, a speed carrot. Neat. What can I do for now? Maybe. Yeah, I can. Nice. We'll probably end by checking this floor. It 
stayed with us well then. What's this? What's the what's what's the 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 Yeah, it was worth a shot. I see you don't have any contraband, which is good. Yeah, we'll go ahead and finish this. Head back down the floor and we'll come back on Sunday. Just wanted to get at least done with... Uh, the chapter we were on, so we could move on to the next one. The Meyer Village. Is, if you had not been there, did one of the house leaders know that mercenaries were staying? In, it will remain a mystery for now. How could? 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 Don't think there's anybody else here. Might be an item though. That's so. Yeah, there might have been, but there wasn't. That is so. But we will say night prayers and we will call it there for a night because I A I'm tired, B I need to get to bed. So let's go ahead and begin. Well, more like end, but still. I will be back Sunday with more Fire Emblem Three Houses. I think we're getting decently far with the game, finally. Do oh. I check one quick thing? Yo, that's where it is. Okay. That's what I thought. Anyways. And yeah, Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and my words, and I have done what I failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault, therefore I ask Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me, to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. All praise to you, O God, this night, for all the blessings of the light. Keep us, we pray, O King of kings, beneath your own almighty wings. Forgive us, Lord, through Christ your Son, whatever wrong this day we've done. Your peace give to the world, O Lord, that man might live in one accord. Enlighten us, O blessed light, and give us rest throughout this night. O strengthen us, that for your sake we all may serve you when we wake. Do not hide your face from me, and you I put my trust. Only by faith in Jesus Christ is a man made holy in God's sight. No observance of the law can achieve this. Lord, listen to my prayer. Turn your ear to my appeal. You are faithful. You are just. Give answer. Do not call your servant to judgment, for no one is just in your sight. The enemy pursues my soul. He has crushed my life to the ground. He has made me dwell in darkness, like the dead long forgotten. Therefore my spirit fails. My heart has been within me. I ponder the days that are past. I ponder all your works. I am used in what your hand has wrought. And to you I stretch out my hands. Like a parched land, my soul thirsts for you. Lord, make haste to answer. For my spirit fails within me. Do not hide your face, lest I become like those in the grave. In the morning, let me know your love, I, for I put my trust in you. Make me know the way I should walk. To you, I lift up my soul. Rescue me, Lord, from my enemies. I have fled to you for refuge. Teach me to do your will, for you, O Lord, are my God. Let your good spirit guide me in ways that are level and smooth. For your namesake, Lord, save my life. In your justice, save my soul from distress. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Do not hide your face from me, and you I put my trust. Stay sober and alert. Your opponent, the devil, is prowling like a roaring lion, looking for someone to devour. Resist him, Saul, in your faith. Into your hands, Lord, I command my spirit. Into your hands, Lord, I command my spirit. You have redeemed us, Lord God of truth. I command my spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, Lord, I command my spirit. Protect us, Lord, as we stay awake. Watch over us as we sleep. Though awake me, keep watch over Christ, and sleep rest in his peace. Christ, the light of the nations, and the glory of Israel. Lord, now you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you prepare in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Protect us, Lord, as we stay awake. Watch over us as we sleep. Though awake, may keep watch with Christ, and sleep, rest in his peace. Let us pray. Lord, fill us night with your radiance. May we sleep in peace and rise with joy to welcome the light of a new day, new day in your name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. May the all-powerful Lord grant us a restful night and a peaceful death. Amen. <sighs> Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. All right, so that will wrap it up. I will be back Thursday to do some Bloodborne. We should be able to make more progress then. So, thank you very much. God bless. Remember that God loves each and every one of you. Go and send no more. Good night, everyone. God bless. <laughs>